by hair, bruh. It's because it's too sh short. Once it gets long enough, it'll be too heavy to stand up, so it's gonna lay down. And that's where you style it. Trust, bruh. Don't touch the top. If you touch the top, I'm gonna beat your fucking ass. Alright. I'm gonna and it just Shelby. blows all crazy in the, in the wind. It doesn't. It's not that long. It is. No, it really does. I'm not even joking. That's how Shelby, okay? <laughs> what? I said I don't tell Shelby, okay? <laughs> Does she have IG? To mm, check her out? I haven't checked, no. You didn't add her on IG? Mm. It's like the number one thing you gotta do first. It's like window shopping. You gotta see if you're gonna buy. That's kind of hard. I came up with that shit on the spot. Oh my fucking god. These cars just run into you on purpose, man. Man, I still barely have any hair like on my chest. I have a little bit, but not enough like to bother me. I've never, really, I've never really been a hairy person. My legs are kind of hairy though. But apart from that, not really. Do you have a patch, like, on your legs, like where your phone and where your keys would go? Because I do. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Do you really? Yeah, like a patch where hair just doesn't fucking grow. Yep. Yeah, I have that shit too. I have to put lipstick on my character because if I don't, like, my lips look, like, super dark and they don't even match, like, it doesn't even look right with my skin. Thanks for stopping by. You're a grown man putting lipstick on? Are you serious? <laughs> on my character. Not in, not in real life. I'm talking about in the game. Alright, bro. If you say so. I'm only selling for two forty-five. What the fuck? That's not worth it. It's full. The prostitute get in this car? They will. I don't need cash though. God, I'm not boogie. Oh hell yeah, if it was Boogie, should be in that car ASAP. <laughs> it's like the peak masculinity, dude. Mmm, I'm only getting 367, what the fuck? You saw him do those, you uh, me? you saw him do those, uh, lateral raises? 10 pounds? Shit. No. What, he's fucking him up or what? He was doing them sitting down, bro. It's not bad. You can do him down. Shit. He's doing bicep curls, 10 pounds each hand. Nah, 10 pounds is insane. <laughs> at like least what? 20. Nah, at least 20 minimum. Like, I mean, I guess he's like never lifted weights, but dude, 
Ten? <laughs> in both hands? <laughs> 20 pounds, yeah. I do, uh... 10 pounds for... 30, 35. For shoulders. 30, 35. Yeah. yeah, that's like what I do sometimes. Sometimes I would do, like, 25, but get, like, a super good, like, stretch, you know? Like a super good, uh, contraction or whatever. But yeah, I would usually stick to, like, 30, 35. I tried 40. I can do 40, but only on hammer. If I do just, like, a regular bicep curl, fuck, man. At least you're not, uh, at least he's not Timothy from freaking 90 Day Fiance. Going to Platinum Fitness and curling the. Fuck that? <laughs> that dude from oh, the, the video. 35 pound or whatever? No, he was curling oh, a 5 pound. Yeah. That video I showed you where, where I sent to the chat where that girl's all like, I like a man that can get his hands dirty. Then he's all like, I'm a mannequin kind of guy, not a finger, <laughs> under the fingernail kind of guy. And she's like, that's because you're a pussy. <laughs> no, but I've never seen that. Yeah, I put it in the chat. It's Where'd like right you say there. It? What, which Snapchat. one? Snapchat. Snapchat. The wood buckeye. When? Like a few days ago. There's a clip of him on I'm 90 Day Fiance. And he's curling like a five pound bar. Like 2.5 on each side with the barbell. He's like just curling that. I'm gonna see you right now. <laughs> Cause that's insane. I don't even know who Tiffy is. Wow. He's this dude that like pulled this like super like bad Colombian chick, but like he's kinda like super feminine and she wants like a masculine ass dude. Mm. So it, it didn't really work. Why would you even try? Cause he like liked her, but he liked like their connection, but like she was like basically just like begging for him to do the deed, you know what I'm saying? But he like wasn't getting the hints, I guess. Which doesn't really make any sense, but... What? She was begging him to smash? Yeah. Okay. And it got to the point where she was uh, like... Yeah, like, you haven't made a move on me. I was starting to think, like, you might be gay or something. <laughs> nah, I'd have to see the video. Yeah. I'm a manicure kind of guy, not a dirt under the finger enough kind of guy. Bro, it's just like... I don't know. That's, that sentence is insane. So he's basically saying he's a woman, right? He's pretty much confirming that he's fruity. <laughs> I'm a manicure kind of guy, not a dirt under the fingernail. Yeah, bro, he's fruity. Yeah, because she wanted him to uh, help help her dad at their ranch in Colombia. He was like kind of scared to do everything. Mm, I could already envision it. Like all, like, <laughs> yeah. Like squirmy, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, and the dude has like no shoulders. You're dude. a pussy. That's because you're a pussy. <laughs> Just straight up, damn. Whose Who shoulders are we talking them? about the other day? Homo, we we're talking about some guy's shoulders. Someone no. being. Yeah, we were. Who were we talking about? I think it was that guy, yeah. I think it was that same guy. I don't know, I think I was talking to my mom about that, actually. I showed my mom that guy. Yeah, clip. I mean, you were talking about some guy. And he was like super small. But we were like, oh, it's just it's just because he has uh, wide shoulders. Who were we talking about? Yeah, I'm talking about, right? <laughs> yeah, I think I remember mentioning, I don't know if I mentioned it to you, but I was talking about how like the shoulders are like the most aesthetic like part of the body if you like, think about it. Because they make everything it makes everything look bigger. Because it opens up your chest, makes your chest look bigger. 
and then it just exactly. makes, you, makes your upper body wider and it makes you your waist look smaller. It looks like a superhero pretty much. They're probably like top three, like most important. To be honest. Like if you have like everything like perfect, like everything your physique is like perfect. But your shoulders are just trash, like that could break your whole physique. Yeah. You really make or break any physique, you know? Yeah, because you've got no shoulders. Yeah. I don't even have to, I can just imagine it. It's gonna be a fake drop off, or it's gonna be a legit one. Mine was legit. I'm going back for another bike. Can we get up this ramp? And get ready. Talking about bachata the other day, we're talking about how like it looks like sexy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like you feel like a womanizer? Yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. Now even fucking Romel Santos um, at his shows, like if, when he's singing, he's like. Ladies, if you feel hot or whatever, like, take whatever you want off. Like, I want you to feel sexy with that. That's where you should look it up. Imagine the guy just start taking their shirts off. <laughs> that was me. I want to hear that other song. Oh, the Vanavanas or whatever? No. Monchi. The Alexandra. I think that song's coming on next. I think those songs are right next to each other on the playlist. Do the same songs always play in order? Oh, it is, yeah. Yeah, they do. Yeah. This song is fire. Alright, where's the, uh, the bike? Yeah, yeah this, this one is fire. I just love the guitar. I feel like I'm playing a uh, ballad of Tony. Yeah, the song fits perfectly in like that game, like GTA 4. Yeah, because uh, Luis always has uh, San Juan sounds playing in his apartment, so you always hear Aventura and Daddy Yankee and all that. Suavemente. That's his sure favorite that game, in game man. radio station, according to GTA Wiki. What even happens at the end of that game? Does he die or what? No, he kills uh, that Russian dude. Yusuf helps him get to the airport, and then you jump out of the helicopter. You jump out of the. The airplane blows up, and then you jump out of it, and you parachute down, and then you meet up with Tony at the park, and then you talk, and then Yusuf shows up, and then you guys walk off. And then Killer come back? Nico? Mm. No, um... What's his name? Like Tony? Forgot his name. Yusuf? No, the main guy. Luis? No, the Luis? Yeah, he's gonna come back. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's gonna come back. 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 Yeah, he's gonna come back.
I can kind of see him coming back in GTA 6, but I don't know. He has a small cameo in this game. He's just on that picture in Tony's office. On the, not the oh, nightclub. Really? Yeah, there's a picture of him on the desk, but he looks older. He has a hat. And starting to get gray hair. Because he was 25 in Ballad of Get Tony. And the nightclub DLC takes place like 2019? So it's literally been like 11 years since the events of Ballad of Get Tony. Well now, since it's 2024, it's been... 4 plus 12, 16 years? Since the, 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 events, coming back. the events of GTA 4? Yeah, I could see him coming back as like a Madraza type character. Like an older guy you just do shit for. Yeah. They brought Johnny back and they killed him off. Really? Yeah, he dies like in the first mission where he plays Trevor. Oh, I remember you shoot him in front of his girl. Yeah. That's right? He doesn't that's, shoot him, he throws that... He, yeah, he throws that beer bottle in his face and then he stomps his head. He stomps like the shards of glass into his head. Right. Yeah. It's kind of sad, but... I didn't really care for Johnny to that much, to be honest, so... Alright, that's Rosalia, good mic, get this shit off. I thought that game was really cool. Like, uh... Motorcycle thought, game, GTA. I thought Ballad Get Tony, like, blew it out of the water. Oh, yeah, obviously, but it was still a cool, like, little spin-off to experience. It was like Vice City. It was like the HD Vice... GTA Vice City. It's like colorful and upbeat. And the other two games are like dark and depressing. I've never played Vice City. I gotta play it. OG Vice City? Oh. I don't even know how. I don't have anywhere to play it though. You know? The Definitive Edition? Oh yeah. Game share it off my game. Wait, which one's the one with Vice City? Who's the main dude? Tommy. Oh. Oh yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Oh, the taxi mission, right? Taxi missions are in like all the old school GTAs. Uh. And then there's Vice City Stories, the one that you played on the PSP. That's uh, play as Vic. You start off at the military base. That's some black guy, right? Some yeah. bald guy? He's Dominican, yeah. Yeah. That one was fire. He's such a cool character. It's sad that he died, too. I don't remember. He dies at the beginning of Vice City, because Vice City Stories takes place in 1984, and Vice City takes place in 86. So he dies right at the beginning of Vice City. Mm. Like off camera? Or they kill him? On screen. Like the opening cutscene of the game. Did you kill him? Nah, he gets killed by, uh... You're doing like a drug deal, and it's like going good, but like, there's like dudes there to steal the drugs and the money off both of you guys, so you get lit up, or he gets lit up by the dudes attacking, and then your guy gets away, and then Lance, if you remember Lance, he gets away too, <coughs> but Vic dies. People say he's like the most relatable GTA character. Vic? Or Lance? Vic. Vic. 
How much did you make off that? Check this shit. I'm out of here. It's like 360. Shit with ass. That's not bad though. I can't enter bunkers while selling. What? Well, you gotta wait. Selling anything. You gotta wait a little oh. bit. You gotta wait until you get the stupid phone call. Uh, from LJC. Yeah. Just Lester with a voice changer. Damn, I got no supplies. actor from Max Payne died and they're remaking the game so I gotta remake them without him. That sucks. Why don't they just use they AI? Just suck, I think too. I mean they could but isn't that like I don't know like unethical? Okay. Yeah. And I don't know what they'll do. I mean, they could find someone to like just replicate his voice. They did that for um, Cold War. No one followed you, right? They got rid of the OG Fine Woods, and they uh, the they got a new actor, but he sounds just like him. Can't be found anywhere but this van, guarantee. Hell of a price, huh? <laughs> Won't be here forever. They didn't get the OG Woods. Oh yeah, they didn't get the OG Woods actor, huh? Mm. Uh, he just did Black Ops 1 through 4. And they didn't get him for Cold War. I don't know why. I remember that before that, Fizz. I don't, I don't even know if Woods is in the new game. Well, no one does, right? I don't even fucking out yet. But. I wonder if it's the same guy. Apparently Mason's dead too. The voice actor? No, like in the game. Oh, which ending in GTA? Which GTA? Which ending in Black Ops 2 is canon? There's multiple endings. Yeah, it's where you shoot. You shoot Mason when he has the bag on his head. I think. You shoot him in the leg. And he then... survives. Like that. Well, apparently he dies in one of the endings, or in one of the missions, right? If you and shoot him in the head, then he's dead, and you can't come. He, he does. He can't come back at all at the end of the game. Or yeah, yeah, that one's canon. I don't really shoot him in the head. People are mad. And uh, Menendez dies in 2025. Uh, I thought the canon ending was Menendez gets arrested and uh, Mason survives and meets up with David and Woods. Uh, who's the dad? Who's the older Mason? David or Mason? Alex. Or I mean uh, Alex. Alex is the older one. David is the younger one. Now what? Uh, let's do those shits you were talking about, if you want. Are you like, where are you at? 
I'm at the gas station. Alright, I'm gonna go to the gun store right now. Oh. Hopefully I can fast travel. Oh, I can fast travel. On, uh, and your thing. If you have, uh... If you're a CEO, you can actually fast travel. I always forget about that. That's cool. Uh, it costs five thousand dollars, so. though. She's only gonna take me to my office. Oh, it's like right there across from the agency, so. It doesn't matter. Yeah, apparently there's like uh these characters that uh everybody pretty much hates and uh you do missions for them if you have the uh auto shop. Missions for who? There's two characters that like everybody hates, like literally everybody that plays GTA like hates them. Uh, this is black dude named KBJ, and then his girlfriend, uh, Ses Santa. You can pretty much just hate him because, like, you're playing the mission, and then they're having, like, a full-on, like, conversation. And, uh, like, while you're doing the mission, they're just, like, flirting with each other, and it's kind of awkward. <laughs> uh, it makes people feel uncomfortable and shit. Uh, some of these weapon skins are sick. Some of them you can't even tell that they have a skin. No, I found out, I think you can get the, uh, the alien weapon. You can get those from, uh, the gun van. Really? Yeah, because I went to the gun van and they had the, the alien minigun for sale, but it was $400,000 and I was I'm sure you can get the the ray gun and the uh, that other thing I have. I have to find it. I would have to spawn. Fuck the boxes in this game. It is? That's on iFruit, huh? Uh Radio Los Santos. Oh really? Oh I didn't I did not know that. I prefer high fashion. Nah, he fell off crazy. He did, right? I, I didn't even realize that. Oh, like crazy. My car is a little pump. Did he really fall off though? Because he doesn't drop music. So, I don't know. Like, did Frank Ocean fall off? He doesn't drop music. He, like, awesome. drops music. I'll be here. And, uh, he drops, like, a banger. And then he just, like, disappears. That's how ASAP Rocky is. He drops, like, a few bangers a year, and then he drops his album, and it sucks. And then he falls off, and then it's just, like, a... Over and over. Alright, it says that we gotta go meet Franklin at the golf course. I'll tell you right here. Yeah. 
I don't know if there's an F on the map for you, but there's an F on the map for me. We gotta meet him. Alright, well, let's go. Okay. The back of this car is ugly. Right, right, okay. <laughs> yeah, point. that's like two giant nostrils. Okay, these are big ass exhaust pipes. Enter the clubhouse to meet Franklin and the VIP client. Probably Dr. J. Oh, no, I, I can't do that. I probably have to send you an invite, huh? Alright, uh, yeah. Uh. Shit, I want to go get water, though. <laughs> I'm thirsty. It's hot. Hold on. We'll get one. We'll get one. Let me charge my headset while I go get one.
My wife's having a bad owner. Every single one of you is going to be blackballed before you reach the ninth team. So that's TJ Perks. This yeah, thing is pretty right. good cutscene. Me and you are going to make some calls and see what's yeah, what. DJ Pooh and the dude from Red Hot Chili Peppers. What the fuck was that about? Man, I told you about this. With everything that's going on in my life. And I got Debo. This is the last fucking thing I need. She's having an affair with the owner? I got to call this guy. Nah, nah, nah. Fuck that and fuck this. If these two guys have what it takes to find my property, then they can definitely take care of this shit. <laughs> we got you, homie. Why do I look like that? Because I'm done with swinging these fucking clubs, man. What are you doing? Listen, take care of these fucking assholes before they make trouble for me. And if you do, you can handle my business. My <clears> phone <throat> wasn't lost, man. Standing in the stolen. back. <laughs> and there's material on that fucking phone that I really care about. Unreleased material. You know what I'm saying? And if you know anything about me, you know that I don't put anything out before it's ready. And I'm dead ass serious about that. We got you, homie. Come on, guys. Let's get the fuck out of here. I'm getting agitated. You were kind of pissed off before they said anything. You is really that the, who is that guy? I feel like I know him. I am. It's called golf. I feel like I know the other guy. <laughs> Next time we're gonna go guy with the mustache. Hey, you two bitches can't wait I got a face. A guy with the mustache. I thought you'd like to talk. Come on, man. Uh, the one with Dre. Yeah, that's red from what the Friday. Fuck is this? Is it? Yeah, it's DJ Poo. Hey, you driving with your eyes closed or what? Hey, get after him, man. Let's go. He's seeing Ooh, kind of like bro. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it looks like this is like a single player mission, and you're just kind of here, just so you have something to do. Hey, yeah. you ain't kill no one, so I got Franklin you right here, and you're probably doing all the work. Kind of like shit. Let me put on some uh, those locals. Fucking slow. Hey, you gotta get out of here. Hey, you gotta get out of here. Hey, you gotta get out of here. This is stupid. Hey, let's do it for the doctor. Come on. <laughs> I'm t bone the shit out of this guy. You saw me? <laughs> no, I'm flipping this dude off. Uh. Hey, play through this. Come on, man. He's giving us a slip. Ah! What did it start without me, man? I had matchmaking on, huh? Sure. Can you just use your guns? Oh my gosh, I hate the way these things handle. Just get behind them, give them a little space, and then go full speed and then ram them. That's what I'm trying to do. I could have ram him pretty hard. Plus. Plus. He's about to ram you. Again. Hey, <laughs> <on>. Motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, so he got me nasty. Yeah. He got out. Wait, he got out. That's one down. Yeah, you gotta ram the other one now. No, 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 no. Oh, that car's gonna get him! <laughs> hey, this ain't dry. Ew, these handles like shit. Way. How the heck are you, Brad? Hell yeah! Oh, I'm about to get him, I'm about to get him. I'm getting him nasty. Yeah. Just do what they do. <laughs> hey, look, lay off a little bit. We need this asshole in one piece so we can have a little talk, alright? Follow him and let's see where he ends up. <laughs> oh shit. You just couldn't keep your fucking mouth shut, huh? <laughs> hey, now this is the day they're gonna be talking about. <laughs> after that party. Put that in the game. listed on the ball sack fire, honey. Of course, he's gonna go all the way to the end of the pier. No. This is max speed, right? Hey, you 
Yeah, it's going way faster than you. What the heck? The game's making me slow down. What the heck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Look at Franklin, yo. Yo, he's dead. <laughs> oh, he didn't see that. That's yeah, funny. Save I'm gonna it. save that so you can see that. Dude, I'm beating the crap out of this dude. Dude, what's going on? I can't even <laughs> hit him. <laughs> oh, now we have to intimidate him. <laughs> oh, you gotta do it. Oh. Stop a miss a train, motherfucker! Uh-uh. Make sure you understand. <laughs> Can I do it one more time? No. I don't know why we're beating him. Is this annoying Dr. J or something? With the golf course? I don't like this outfit. I think he does some thinking. Let me call Dre real quick. Hey, Dre. Take care of that thing. Nah, you won't be hearing from him no more. But what about that other thing? Alright, cool. Look, send it over, we'll get right on it. Is it you I right mean, there in the cutscene, or is it me? Not, not you. Yeah. Damn. 24k for that. There's really no leveling up, right? After like 100, you get everything. Yeah. After 125, yeah. What do you get? What do you get at 125? The mini. Do you get like car shit? Oh, you get no, more car stuff, yeah. No, you get the RPG at 100. Oh. Uh. The mini gun you get at 125. Okay, we're just smoking weed. What the heck? Why'd I get 50 grand? Did you also get 50 grand? Uh-huh. Franklin will be in touch soon with the plan to recover Dr. Dre's stolen phone. That's stupid. Call Apple. It said I got a t-shirt. Everything okay? I um, like the golf outfits. I'm not gonna wear that shit. I'll be here. Look at anything in here. Oh, I found the safe. It's in my office. Eminem. Okay, Eminem is terrible. Yeah, I don't, I don't listen to Eminem. This guy took me out of my car. Him and Mr. Clinton used to work together. Got really angry when I said he wasn't a. Where do we gotta go? Hey, 
Hey, you know the. I'm mean, gonna just said me and Dre are like dog hairs. What's up? All right, bro. I'll wrap it up. That's an old Eminem. Gospel? Yeah, this is old and man. Uh, like with the beard and, and the toro. Your beard is weird. Fucking, someone pass me a clip this. Fucking beard is weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's cause probably like, yeah, this shit's hard. <laughs> I remember you said that that song was the better song, but Eminem's song had a better diss. Yeah, I still stand by that. Like, I could listen to MGK in the car, but, um, not really Eminem's, you know? Yeah. Can I Lamar did both, though, and he fucking roasted, uh, Drake. Like, he dissed them, and he could put that shit in the whip. That's which song, Not Like Us? Yeah. Shit. They not like us, they not like us, they not like us. This man? Oh yeah, you gotta look up that Timothy Foo. Yeah, I never did. Shit is hilarious. What? Oh, protect the wine barrels. I'm just trying, bro. Yeah, for some reason, my mind is gonna be... Heck, this is new. Straight kick down enemies carry Molotov. This is your car? Sorry, what is it? Is it Is this your car? I don't know. Oh. It's pretty far. Oh yeah, I think it is. That's the one you get if you do all the DAX missions. You just get it for free, they just give it to you. Damn! Quick! Selector, too. Yeah, I should do those. Yeah, I'm gonna do them then. Yeah, I'll do them. I'll help you do them. Well, we have to wait for freaking Franklin's call anyway. I don't know how long it's gonna take. You oh, you can only do the missions too. when he calls you? Franklin, yeah. What oh, the fuck? Them? There's a Molotov signal like, right here, but I don't see him. Oh, damn. He the, freaking, the freaking computer took down this dude. Why are they coming on bikes? That's not a good idea. Where? You get you get the virtue like exactly how it looks like that or you customize it? It comes like that. I left it the same. Oh, that's fire. Um but I upgraded everything because it wasn't too left over. Ooh, what? Like, I had to put on, like, the turbo and all that still, but it came like that, pretty much. Like, with the livery and everything. I went far. Yeah. It's like a $1.6 million car, so... Good investment. Doing the missions. <laughs> and if you have the, uh... If you have the agency... 
that car is eligible for uh, this thing called Money Tech. And basically what it is, is you can put uh, this thing on your car that makes it so that uh, your car doesn't get targeted by um, like the, the missiles, like the lock-on missiles. It jams them. Oh, that's OP. Yeah. And then you can also, uh, I did it for fun, just because I wanted to see, I was curious what it was. You can, uh, like, vehicle, like, remote control your own car. So you can control your car without you being in it. You can, like, drive it around without you being in it. That's cool, how do you do that? You have to buy that upgrade. You have to have an agency to do it, though. That it? Mm. I see them coming down the highway. I think down side pretty cool. So many, oh my god. Oh, no. oh yeah, good idea coming on a bike. <laughs> this idiot crashed. Is that it? Mmm. -hmm. Oh, I guess you gotta do it until the time runs out. Oh, oh I didn't even see the timer. That's dumb. Then we're kind of penalized for killing more enemies because we're just wasting ammo. Pretty much. So if we kill enemies, it's just gonna spawn more. <laughs> I'm thinking of that freaking Conan Ice Cube Kevin Hart skit. <laughs> oh, Diana Chang. I think it's the other one where they do the Uber. Uh. And then I'm like, you ever been robbed? No. And then Ice Cube robs them. <laughs> or you pretend to rob them? I haven't seen that. I don't know, have you seen that I one? I don't know. Oh, sure. <laughs> and then Conan's like, that's what we do. You play with the comedy kit and I take all their money. <laughs> What the heck? I've never seen a green timer before. What does that even mean? I went to clear? Oh. Shit, he almost killed me. What the fuck? Oh, you did die. Why are they all trying hard? Oh, they could. Forty nine K. That's it. That's pretty good. The uh, like that was a mission. Hey Park. Shit, good work out there. I knew we paid. Get business now. Look, head back to the office when you get a sec, alright? 
I says go back to the office, talk to Franklin and that chick. Unless you want to do the Dax missions, we can do those. We can get the car. Yeah, we're done. Uh, you gotta go to the freak sh freak lab or whatever. Are you gonna keep the library like this? Or are you gonna change it? I don't know. I'd have to see it. I'll see. Yeah. This car is clear. The... Yeah, is it a supercar? It might be one of the fastest supercars right now. How much does it cost, actually? Let me see. I'll go to the website. Yeah, it is super. It is... 2.3 million. Damn. <laughs> yeah, they just give it to you. It just shows up as like a yellow car on the map and then they send you a text saying, oh yeah, hey, like, we got this for you or whatever and then you just go. As soon as you get in, it's gonna ask you where you, what garage you want to store it in. Shit. Because what's um, Osla supposed to be? Porsche? Jaguar? Uh. Oh, Osla. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Vapid is Ford, uh, Dinka is Honda, mm. Ravedo is Dodge, Oslo is Jaguar, Obey is uh, Audi. I'm not sure what Canis is. Oh my God. And, uh... Oh. Pegasus, or is it, uh... The Pegasi? Yeah. Like yeah, that's supposed to be a uh, Lamborghini. Hey, I can hit the gritty when I got out. Stop! Stop right there! Oh, this Don't is the one I saw you do. Step or we're all going to die. Okay? Just stay there. The slightest movement could send us off flying. You still out there? <laughs> you still have yeah, to be Hanging on by a thread. Fresh meat, get over here. No, no, move! Don't listen to him. Come on. 